I was like, why are you so obsessed with me? Hi everyone, it's Mariah Carey here. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. My name is Emily and today we are doing the Mariah Carey transformation. <laughs> So as you guys can see, I did a transformation into Mariah Carey for the holidays and I love this look. I'm so obsessed. I feel like I really do look like Mariah Carey. So if y'all want to hype me up in the comments down below, um, that would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> um, but I really enjoyed this look and I had so much fun. I just like, I don't know, it just made me so happy filming this. So please give it a big thumbs up. <laughs> start off with is contour. Mariah Carey does have very structured facial features from nose, cheekbones to her jawline. So you really want to hit those points. I'm going to be taking the Kylie bronzer in almond. fishy face so and I'm gonna bring it in a little bit more so I'm gonna bring it in to get those cheekbones jawline and I do have like more of a rounder face so I'm gonna go kind of heavy with this Look at the difference that that's already making. Like, I'm looking snatched. So, now we're gonna blend it out. I'm gonna go in with a fluffier brush, kind of blend down my neck so it's not just like a sharp line. But you do kind of want it a little bit more defined because you are going for a different person's like facial feature. So, um, if you already have like a really good jawline, then I'm jealous of you, but you can um, do this more, like you can get it done easier because you have that. So we're gonna blend down, but still look snatched. Let's get into blush. I'm gonna be using this Morphe 9B palette. Such a good palette for blush, especially if you're a freelance makeup artist. So, so good. The blush is very pigmented. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go in with a pink kind of shimmery shade and you're going to focus it more in the center, um, of your cheeks. When I do my blush, I kind of go out up into the contour, but you're going to focus it right in the center of your cheeks. So you're going to smile. eyebrows I already have pretty thick eyebrows um, I just kind of reshaped them a little bit but my eyebrows are thicker than hers but hers also are kind of like a old-school type I would say 
they're a little bit rounded in the front and then they go thin. So that might be a little bit hard to do, but we can do it. So let me go ahead and start off with a light brown eyeshadow. That's another thing is my eyebrows are a lot darker than hers. So you're gonna go in with a lighter shade. Now we're going to go into the eyeshadow. She doesn't do a lot for eyeshadow, so I'm just going to be picking up a kind of light brown beige kind of shade. And I'm just going to be focusing now on the outer part of our eye. shade from the James Charles palette. have a mole by her lip I'm pretty sure it's a mole so when she smiles it's like right here I'm gonna take a little bit of that brow gel so now that we are done with the face we're going to go in with our lipstick Mariah Carey always wears a nude lip she never really goes for like the bold red lip or anything so we're just gonna stick with a new lipstick and her lips are pretty, they're not small, but she definitely doesn't have like filler or anything. If she does, you can't really tell. But I'm just gonna stick with my normal lip um, size. I'm not gonna overline or anything today. But yeah, we're gonna go in with Nutmeg by MAC. This was in their holiday collection last year. It is such a pretty color. I definitely recommend getting it. I'm using the lip glass and it's in the shade boy bait this is the finished Mariah Carey look I hope you guys enjoyed the video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below don't forget to turn on your post notifications and please leave me a comment down below so we can chat and I'll see you guys in my next video bye